Hello there and welcome back to Cory Loses, where today we are once again continuing our Thrawn's Revenge Imperial Civil War 2.3 preview playthrough as the Empire. In the last episode we had a pretty major set of battles over Liana. Uh, we secured De Severo and took out a bunch of the CSA's space forces, uh, clearing out their space forces over Meridun or Metalorn by drawing them over to Liana. Uh, today we are going to start off by building another set of lancers for that fleet because they got pretty hammered there. We did also queue up our executor class, Decadence, over uh, over Biss. And we do have enough credits to probably start building some more units. Uh, but let's get Bill Bringy built up a little bit. Uh, the New Republic is back over Kuat. So... We had the fleet that retreated up to this side, which was moving back into Kuat. I'm not sure where exactly it is at the moment. Uh, I think this is it. Yeah, with the Sovereign. I think, yep, that's them. Uh, so we... I really want to take out Kashyyyk. That would stop all their movements through this area. Uh, but let's get Corellia built up a little bit, too. Building under construction. So there we go. And once these guys are in at uh, in with our fleet up here at Liana, then we'll be able to invade there. So let's get them in position. And we'll try to invade that right away. I'm not sure if they're going to try to cancel production at some of these planets, but hopefully not. How much is left? We're in 37% for that. Uh, let's get you there. This is going to be a bit of a problem. I don't think I gave them a Pathfinder. So we... I don't know if we're going to have enough PopCap to fit the, the Sovereign with everything. But this is the fleet that we came into uh, at Kashyyyk, I think. Yeah, we did have a Pathfinder. I'd much rather fight them here, so... I might actually stay here. I was gonna wait until we had some Lancers for this, but... This may have to be what we settle for. Maybe we can take anything out surrounding this, too. Nope. No luck. Okay, let's try to make sure we don't get completely killed by these fighters and bombers. Alright. You know what? Hunt. It's going to be a while before our next super laser shot, but we do have an HV gun shot coming up. Which I think is going into this MC-90 as well. Let's see if we can send out the rest of our fleet. Without these MC-90s, they don't have as much to threaten us. Uh, the fighters were taken care of pretty easily. And we might even be able to move in from here to Kashyyyk because of that. So they decided to fly into the super laser hyper velocity gun combination. Well, they didn't fly into the super laser. The super laser came later. It came super later. That reporting bombers go for this. Right away. See, they're flying around the fire. The stations again. We're probably going to lose Merciless here. Right, let's try to focus down these guys as they come. Your orders. 
HV gun. Where's that other MC90? Let's just keep it on that one. Oh, come on. I know you don't do much damage MTCs, but... Need to get that. Even more MC90s. I don't know how many they have. I don't want to have to fall back. But we might. We might need to. There's what? Three MC90s, four MC90s. What's that? We're gonna start taking damage on the Sovereign soon. Why are you aiming like a drunk person? Okay. I was really relying on that HV gun to help here. And it's not going to, so... I don't want to risk losing the engines on the Sovereign by killing that! Oh. That is really unfortunate. So not worth it. Ready to go. Should I get more defenses, I guess? Alright, let's focus where we're strong right now. Ah, oh, crap. They're going for it with Silgol. I don't think we're going to be able to beat that with what we have here. Let's try it. Double Silgo. Yes, sir. Got we it. secured a landing zone. Ready to go. Scouting. Can I help? We'll do. Ready. At your service. Yes, can do. Okay, well, at least the civilians can probably deal with that artillery. Let's get anti-infantry there. Anti-infantry there. Ready. I got me. Can I assist you? Got it. Construction complete. Are they still going to be deployed here? Yes. Okay, well, still got it. And there's a Sogol in there. Okay, so... I'm not sure if it's a double in the company or what. Or if they somehow spawn too. That might be it. Because most of the spawns were moved to the Lua stuff. And there might be one of the XML ones still in there. So we'll have to see when she gets dropped off. Just come up the... Play a little Mon Cal Jedi. I actually really like Silgul. Well, that was excessive. Roger that. 
reporting in. Form up. Awaiting orders. Scanning for enemies. Can you guys go for a military target? I guess these guys are armed and firing at you, but still. I really want to rework how all these ground civilians things works because they they have no real impact and they're kind of annoying. So I'd rather have like actual militia forces in a more organized way. Hey, are you going to invade me now? See if we can get to the bridge, actually. It's a bit late now, but... What is killing Silco? I forget if there's more build pads here. Mm-hmm. Okay, don't worry about it. Ah! My sights this way. Scouting. Reporting over there. Get over here. Yes, sir. Roll out. Because these two are a little bit close together. Deploying. In attack. Okay, she can't deflect a vehicle fire as well. I really wanted the turrets for this. Still decent against vehicles, but Jedi are more anti-infantry. Yeah, there's definitely two Sogols. Alright. We're just going to have to stick with these ones. Yes, Commander. Form up. Now both are in there? On the move. Ready. Initiate sweep. Awaiting orders. Scouting area. Fire at will. Moving to secondary position. Setting course. The shield will come back. All damage won't. Die, Jedi! Die, Jedi! I'd trade this for another... There we go. Unfortunately, we don't get to see both Silgals at once. They were inside the thing. But we saved Kuat, so there's that. Ish. Uh, yeah, there was no way we were winning that fight. They had three more Home 1 types in reserve. Alright. Let's take out Liana then. They're going to help against the civilians. And by that I mean our civilians. So I suppose I should try to help them instead. Forward. 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 
Okay, let's send those over there. They're a little bit faster. So you can stay over here and help with this. So it's the Ma. Yeah, this is another economic plan. Our poor ATPTs. You guys can head up. Can you handle a GX12? I think you can handle the GX12. The the Espo Walkers are a little OP right now, but we'll see how that how, how that plays out. So that didn't play out very well for us. The Espo Walkers are super OP. Can you actually shoot it? Please? There we go. Alright. So that should be it. Let's see, do they die to the... Oh, it doesn't matter yet. They don't have the hard point changes. We made it so that uh, the weapons on infantry were targetable hard points, which kind of looks cool. But we'll see if that uh, if that changes how effective bombing runs are against them. Because hard points and AOE damage, they seem to have issues mixing. So if it's something we have to revert, we'll revert it. Like they're always they're always hard points. Uh, they're just not coded as hard points that you can hit right now, like as separate little bits of health and whatnot. But in the main dev version, they are. This is a little bit behind that. A couple months now. Building started. All right. Each of our fleets has been fairly depleted, except for Pelions, which is doing all right. I don't want to remove the fleet from there, then they'll just attack it. So let's send in this fleet from Entrala to Corellia to reinforce them. And here at Garros, let's get the AI combat power pack. Porto does finish things. God type of velocity guns. Nero's Lament. Construction complete. At Roche. We get Hand of Blood, USS Enterprise back, Autark, and we'll try to send them over to this fleet. We do have uh, this guy here, who I think we'll send into Eddie. Yeah. His name again? Ardax? Bro. Building under construction. Tactical battle imminent. All right, there's one of the CSA's heroes. Basically, their best one, I think. There's a bulwark three, so this could be difficult. Incoming. He's hidden in there, so I don't want to go too far right now. We do have a Praetor, so Einstein's Revenge. Eldridge of Hyrule. Dalby. Allegiance. 
I should swap in the version with the fixed smoothing. I copy. Bob did fix that after the last stream. Weapons online. Choose your reinforcements. Ardax with his bad but still a combat bonus. Uh, who's this? This is back to the Z list. Autark. Oh, wait a minute. In a tector. Let's move out. So Autark, we got double queued up there. Star Destroyer standing by. I think. Star Destroyer reporting in. We'll have to check. Unless something's name didn't get applied properly. So we'll have to check that too. Autark may be something else. One of them at least. Weapons charged. Even I make mistakes sometimes. Uh are you just heading towards a Lancer? You yes, are. Okay. Commander. I mean, I guess you can't beat this part of the fleet at all, so... At will. You may as well. Oh well. Uh, which one were you, Eldridge? Roger that. Form up. Fall out. Targeting. Destroyer here. Attacking primary target. Let's go. And you guys in. There we go. For the Empire. Let's move out. Star Destroyer standing by. Weapons charged. Intercepting. So you showed up on that side. I guess I'll make this easier for you. Or no, I won't. Let's see if it works this time. I guess it's dead. Yes, Alright, let's turn around and take out the... This little, or Lucra Hulk. Now Grumpy's gonna head back to us. He's one of the first... Like, all the CSA units are first on the list of uh, units that are gonna be getting a custom portrait, ideally, uh, that Valerie's working on between concepts. So we don't have to use a picture from Gilligan's Island. Which, well, a funny reference is not uh, not ideal. Let's focus down these quad turbo lasers. We don't lose the hero. As shitty as he is. And this last squad here. Rumby's gonna be coming out somewhere. See, there's Grumpy, okay. We'll have the engines added, uh, the texture for that soonish. Uh, okay. We're gonna go meet them. Okay, you're just gonna go straight for Sloan. There's nothing out here. Okay, everything's good. 
Ideally, you're going to be able to get to Grumby first, but he's not going to focus you regardless. Oh, well. There. I guess you'd better go that way then. Attacking. Reporting. Uh, so you can go over this way. The missile launchers are the primary targets. Target. Roger that. Destroy those lasers. Watch your back. Pursuing enemy forces. I copy. The lasers are our target. Regroup. Directing all fire. All right, Sloan's almost dead. You are almost in range for Grumpy. No, 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 no. No, no loops. Whatever. We're going to lose some units for this. Can you just fly past him? Okay, Atark, you're going way over this way. Wait, I think we're almost past the firing arcs. You're almost in. No, 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 no. He's, yeah, it's dead. Well, let's still take out the engines first, just in case they try to retreat. Or get out of range or something. In this precarious situation. Alright, so, failed retreat for you. Oh, they got away with the Citadel. Never mind. Joke's on me. We did lose Eldred of Hyrule and Fighter Popper. But, oh, that must, that's why the retreat didn't work. Because it's the, it's a patron unit, it doesn't have the script attached. So, that's unfortunate. If I had checked the name, I would have known that. Or if my brain was working properly at the time, I would have known that. Tactical battle imminent. End our planetary battle. Well, soon these guys will be wiped out. We've come across enemy units. Well, that's too close to the starting thing. They're running out of stuff there. Uh, we'll go from Eddie straight to Ession, and then they won't be able to reinforce those forces at Severo. Or sending ground stuff at Severo. Construction complete. Meridune. Uh, let's see. We get Eldred's back. We get Missile Warlord Star back. Springhawk. Penguin Strikes back. And Inconvenience. Here at Garros, let's add in Thunder Supplies. Uh, Fighter Papper. Okay, let's see if we can invade Eddie er, successfully. 
And that'll be that'll be the the end of the episode, I think. Choose your reinforcements. Order acknowledged. Roger that. You guys run down to right that. On my way. Because there should be way, a sensor back. there. We'll get you guys to go scout that with them. Armor transport ready. They're in this direction. Reporting in. Attacking target. Just give me a target. I will there. Awaiting orders. Okay, you're gonna get up there. Crap. I think Espo Walkers must have the the AV turret or projectile too. That'll have to change. I think that projectile has to change in general. But here, you're gonna head down this way. Come to bees. They're they're okay with that now. I'm gonna send the ATAT -AT down here to start dealing with those Espo walkers. Yes, the lighter vehicles finish off the Reporting. air attack. Roger that. In attack position. These guys have nothing they can use against air units. But this has to die first. Awaiting orders. All right, we'll have to get one of the reinforcement points. Ready. Firing. Above. Here we go. Support order acknowledged. Bombing run available. Let's move out. Support order acknowledged. Where's their capital? CSA headquarters right there. You guys can come in this direction. Get ready. Alright, head up this way all together now. You get back there, that strike cruiser, strike breaker is going to be an issue for you. Oh, there's also the local office here. That's what. Yeah, so didn't see that. Up, oh, looked out of the window. All right, let's actually take out the local office first. Did they kill all the stormtroopers? This isn't good. We'll have to use our ATAT -AT reinforcements to grab the 
this guy. Alright, I wanted to save this, but just to make sure we get something out of it. Strike breaker, strike breaker, strike breaker. Strike breaker. Come on. That's my walkers. In. You're gonna kill the strike or the Espo walkers. You're gonna kill the Espo walker. You're gonna look at the Espo walkers, and you're gonna kill the Espo walkers. None of whatever you're doing, you need to actually look at stuff and shoot it. Okay. I don't want to have to use the bombers this way, but... It's... <laughs> yeah, it just turned around. <laughs> it's a weird limitation when it, uh... It's deployed, I guess. Okay. Here we go. Roger that. Do we have any of the soldiers still? Any of the stormtroopers? Yes. Okay, we're gonna go to this side for this. And you're gonna go over here. So that's gonna be a repair station. Let's see if we can get this back. I don't know if they still left any Espos up there. If they did, we'll have to send more stuff to help deal with that. But I don't think they did. No, we can capture it. All right, so orbital bombardment and bombing run, one of the two. Should be enough for that. Let's send the bombing run over here. Orbital bombardment. Bombardment available. On this. Okay, then let's see what do they have left unit wise. Reporting. You're gonna go deal with that. Heading up. Good stuff. Yes, come on. You up this way. Yes, with Keep with the going. boys. Ready. Rolling out on some CSA guys with the boys. Fire at will. Let's go. Keep going. Okay, this section is gonna be handled by that ATAT. -AT. This section is gonna be handled by that ATAT. -AT. And they can still kinda go between them a little bit. But... Transport ready. Acknowledged. Destination set. Over here. Ready. Over this here. Way. Reporting in. Attacking. You still got that. That's probably a bombing run right there. Roger that. Targeting. Yes, sir. Warm up. Proceeding bombing to run target. available. Ready for orders. Ready to go. Awaiting orders. Targeting. Awaiting your orders. Okay. On this one, I'm just going to walk through that way. Always ready. ATSTs handle that. ATAT, go handle the barracks they're going to come from. 
You're gonna walk down that road towards whatever they end up putting over there. I don't know where that strike breaker. Oh, there it is. There's the jail speeder. Strike breaker is somewhere. All right, so they are all locked into the main city here now. Trying to hide in buildings. I thought there was another actual strike breaker, not just the jail speeder. It must have been just the jail speeder there. Alright, so that's Eddie, that's their capital. Did lose a few units for that, but I think that's worth it. A couple grand forces for their capital. And then next episode, we'll be able to move straight in on Ession. Uh, that'll split even their main territory up a little bit. They'll still have Saffalor, Bonnet, and Atchorb to Eolshaw and Cernpiddle. But they're not the best planets. Those uh, Saffalor's level 2 at best. Uh, Ession and Eddie are their best planets in, uh, in their actual territory. And then they have these three. But we'll be able to close in on those. And they've wasted a lot of their forces in that. Or not wasted, but we've killed a lot of them. Uh, what are they down to? 15%. Yeah, and they were at 20% at the end of the last episode. Uh, so, good progress, I think. We're still in the process of building up our fleet. I'd say rebuilding, but we were only so far to begin with. Uh, we might even start using Pelions a little bit. But I uh, hope you guys are enjoying this series so far. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!